I'm reinforcing the chicken tractor today. Uh, really didn't have the extra money to do it, but I had to go out and do it anyway. Chickens are worth more to me than, than the money in my pocket. I love my little birds. I'd have been really sad if one of my little silky babies had got hurt. As it is, I'm quite angry that I lost a bird right now. Really angry. And uh, I want to make sure it doesn't happen again. Not out of the chicken tractor. Crazy thing is, I was going to re reinforce it today. Today. The plans were on my calendar to reinforce this chicken tractor today. How weird is that? Uh, Raccoon must have known what I was thinking. Because he didn't give me the time. He did not give me the chance to work on it. So I went and got some heavy duty wire. It's stiffer. It's much stiffer than this stuff. Probably because of the tighter weave. And instead of stapling it on, because the raccoons can pull out staples with time. They'll work on the wire. I see he's been pulling and pushing and wrenching on the wire. He didn't rip out any staples, but he was working on it. He was trying. Um, funny enough, he did not damage any of the other wires anywhere. What he did was ate the bird through the cage, which I... Um, did not expect to see that happen to it, a full-sized adult chicken. That's uh, quite upsetting, especially one that was laying on my eggs. She was broody, and she was laying on eggs. So, it's not a loss I'm willing to take quietly. So I'm going to staple this and wire it make sure that, that that this is really secure. So I'm going to go around the entire chicken tractor with that wire. It's the finer mesh. Uh, I can barely get my fingers through it. So now there will be two layers of wire on there. So hopefully it will be a lot stronger. And then my plans are to figure out why the, uh, the electric fence isn't working and get it patched up and repaired. And run a, some electric fence around the chicken tractor as well. It's been a couple hours. I'm really taking my time and doing this up heavily. These are my little babies and they're so cute and they love me. I put three, four hundred staples in just here. I think four hundred staples just up to the door, jumped up to the frame of the door. I still got to put a reinforced section up here and I'm going to put a piece of wood trim along the edge of the floor to secure the wire. He didn't get in, but he did work some of the staples here out. That's a, that's a weak point. Raccoons are amazing. They're so intelligent. They will find a weak point in your defenses. And a friend of mine was just telling me that, and I know it's a fact. They will find the weak point. And that was the weak point. He actually had that. He had a few staples, three staples ripped out. And, uh, well, I guess probably from pulling at the bird, he weak, worked that loose. I don't think he got in, but he managed to reach his paws through and grab her. And I've seen it done. I've actually seen through the years the uh, birds that were injured through chicken wire. Now he'll still be able to reach through this stuff, but at least it's doubled and it's a stiffer wire. So it'll be a little bit more resistance for him. Maybe the bird would have more opportunity to escape in this case. 
But if they're sleeping too close to the edge, there's nothing I can do at night. There's just nothing I could have done. If she was up close to the edge, then, then that's, that's why it happened. But anyway, I am going to work around the other side. I'll let you watch as I go. The baby birds are pretty scared, so I'm pretty sure they know what was going on last night. They're sticking really close to me. Come on, little chirpies. Come on, guys. Come on, chirpies. Come on. Come on, chirpies. Now well, some of them come. Come on, guys. Come on. See, it's cute. They'll come to me. Hey, that's my finger. This one right here especially is a lovey bird. It comes to me all the time. It likes to be rubbed. And eat my finger. That's my finger. You can't eat that. Now what I'm doing here, I'm weaving wire in so that if he pulls on one of these, he's pulling on both. And this will slow him down a little bit so that he's got to pull out all the staples from both rows of wire, from both uh, sets of wire, in order to get into this chicken tractor. Rather than uh, just a single set of staples. So it's just an extra layer of defense for my little birds. Now, one more level of defense. This is why this is taking me hours, but my birds are. Oh, well, they're my babies here. Another layer, level of defense is to go around the frame and out all the way around the entire frame and this means that raccoon cannot pull this off he can't Oops, I'm not, I shouldn't have done the corner I should do this piece first I'll do this row here
Now that side's done. Now I've just got the end to do here. And then we'll be done. It's taken me a long time, but it's got to be done. Just imagine, it takes me a couple hours to put this together. But that raccoon, he's got all night to try to figure out how to tear it apart. You'll notice there's traps sitting around me. I've got my traps out. I will be using them every day from now on. The traps will not go unset. They will be set from now on every night forever. One 25 foot roll is enough to do the entire chicken tractor. Now, cut the corners off and we're done. Well, putting it on anyway. And then I have to do the front wall. The upstairs in the front where he ate her, that chicken through. That's where he was able to get her. So that's where we've got to really concentrate. He'll be back. He's gonna try the same thing. He knows that's a weak spot now. He'll probably be back tonight for more. I'm even wrapping the ends around. A little bit of overlap on the corners, extra security. All four corners will have a little bit of extra overlap. More is better. That way there's no weak spots in this. In my armor. Next, we wire it all up. So he'll never be able to pull it off of the frame. Well, that's as good as it's going to get there, all the way around. I still have to do the middle, the peak here. I'll do that next. Well, there it is. Now, I'm just gonna thread uh, some more wire through any weak points that I can find. This is gonna become a chicken bunker here. It's gonna be strong. I'm not taking any more chances. Now, the thing is, I messed up. 
raccoons usually go for the the easiest target and they'll go for the traps in my experience they'll go for the easiest food to get to but all three traps were emptied out this morning and a chicken was killed so it must have been more raccoons multiple raccoons and they didn't get caught the traps weren't set properly the, rac the traps weren't even sprung so it was pointless so uh, tonight I'm going to do it out better 